everybody, I think that went to Washington, you know, thought about Washington. It's Coach Sarkis, he's just a good guy, you know, he's, a every, he's an everybody guy. So, you know, I like that. Why, why'd you come here instead? Uh, here, just the tradition, you know, staying home, and it's nothing but the best, you know. I feel like I'm competing with the best. How has the whole experience been for you so far? I mean, was your head kind of swimming a little bit at the beginning? At first, you know, uh, it, it got overwhelming, real overwhelming. Uh, last year we used numbers, and here it's uh, words. So, you know, it, it was hard to transfer, you know, uh, transition. So I, they uh, the other quarterbacks just been helping me. Yeah. How much did you play under center in high school? Under center, actually, we played a good portion. You know, my first couple years we didn't, but, you know, senior year, heading in, you know, going here, we had to start changing the pro. So uh, I'm, I'm working on it more, but not as much as I am now. So you're comfortable mm -hmm. doing dropping back versus being in the shotgun? Oh, yeah, practice every day, you know, it gets you better. You know, I think all of us came in here a little rusty, you know, from summer break. We had a little break messing around. But uh, coming here, Coach Helton, Clay Helton, he just got us all right, you know. That's how we got to be. Besides the uh, the playbook, what's been the most challenging aspect of you know, coming here and starting college and all that? Um, probably just the, the just by yourself, you know, the maturity, responsibility. you got to get up on your own. Nobody's going to push you. It's just you gotta watch them on your own. It's a job, you know. You gotta treat it as a job. It's your career. Um, do you sort of take it upon yourself to do that stuff? Oh yeah, definitely. You know, uh, you got to because it's like basically this is your future, and you know, you gotta feed your family sooner or later. You had a pretty rough opening scrimmage. Uh, how much do you think you've improved since that first performance? Um, since the first performance, you know, uh, I've had the older guys, you know, to help me, you know, in my experience. Uh, experience. You know, I was elongated, I wasn't comfortable, I was throwing the ball too high, too low, you know, and the guy was just like, hey, just treat it like it's high school. You know, the older guys, you know, looked, looked down to me and said, hey, just just relax, you know, be you. Yeah, I know you're better than that, I just got comfortable. You say you're elongated, you're talking about your stride? Yeah, my stride was elongated, you know, I was just all, all over the place. You know, I just felt like I needed to make an impression, but they said you don't have to make an impression, you know, you're young. You just getting in here. You don't know. You don't know too much. So just, just be you. When you say they, you're talking about Matt, and Matt, Mitch Matt, primarily? Mitch, Matt, Mitch, everybody. Uh, offensive lineman got in there stuttering. First time I got in there stuttering. <laughs> so you know they, they just they helped me move along. Yeah. Does it mean anything to you have the coaches you know want to use you to emulate locker? Oh, not at all. Actually, that's a privilege. You know they say because it's basically like giving you this role. They think you could play this role. You know to give it to a specific person. I think that's. Wonderful. Have you learned anything from it so far? Oh, I, I, yeah, definitely. Uh, I learned that Jake Locker's a competitor. You know, the guy's smart, real smart, and makes uh, good plays. Bro. Very, very. He develops plays by himself, and that's how they. That's how they win. Is that, you're throwing a lot more passes when you're on the scout team than in a normal mm -hmm. practice, right? So mm -hmm. Is that a big adjustment for you? This oh, week? not at all. Uh, I think that's one of the reasons why they uh, made me go to scout. You know, just get my feet wet because mm -hmm. I've just been standing at practice. Now that I know the game a little bit more, you know, they, they implement me over there because I got I got the res responsibility of game maturity yeah. to uh, watch them on my own, do work on my own, throw on my own. Is that also a way for you to kind of get the coach's eye and say, hey, he's, he's working hard on the scout team? Not at all. That's just a role they gave me, and I'm just filling the job. But uh, in, the, in the context of running that, like the scout team offense, do you get to show some things that maybe in the, the framework oh, yeah, of the real offense that you don't? Oh, definitely. You know, uh, I see that as more uh, as a job. So, you know, I got to feel like I, I got to make a play, you know, get the defense right. Yeah, that's a job. You know, I feel like you got to make a big impact. Right?